No, you're on now, so you oh. can take it away when you're ready. Talk about whatever oh it is. Oh my gosh. Okay, so single life in your 40s, right? Like, so eventually you decide you're going to dip your, your toes into like online dating, which for the most part is not good. <laughs> no, it's but, like um, you, it's like, it's like the pool is shallow. Shallow. The pool is shallow. Just peed in it. Which is fine. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> Someone peed like, in it. Like, men should be in therapy and not on dating sites. That is but, true. That is true. They use they use dating sites as free therapy. Yes. Right. I'm not your mom. Yes. So, but, what kind of comments are you getting from these guys? <laughs> I'm just curious. Like, what, what therapy? Like, well, yeah, like, it's you just, look like a tall glass of milk. Milk? <laughs> definitely not that one? Yes. <laughs> oh, that's. That's an opening line. Oh my god. You look like a tall glass of milk. That's what yeah. they said to you. Right. What else? Now I'm just super curious. Yeah, mine are boring because they were just like, they'll be like, hi. And I'm like, okay, I. Have... Do, you, do you respond to the highs or no? Sometimes. It depends. If I'm bored, you know. But, um. It's like, it's like pulling teeth. Like, why are you even on here if you don't want to have a conversation? Well, I think they're. But I don't think it's like, don't. The young kids. kids that are asking yeah, if you want like more 15 kids. Fifteen years younger or whatever, and, and then yeah, there's a lot it's of, like, will you change your mind? Absolutely not. I'm not gonna change. Yeah, my there mind. was there was one like one was young kid that catfished. Like so, his his profile picture was actually a very handsome silver fox, right? Like right. you know, with the beard, very good. And you're like, oh, oh, this looks this looks promising, very promising, right? right? Yeah. Some tattoos, kind of built. And then you scroll down, and he's like, just kidding, and it's like this 18 year old scrawny kid. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> but now that I got your attention. Oh, my favorite one was the guy who. We have to tell you a story. It was... Yeah, you, you're skipping on the story altogether. Okay, okay, tell so, the story, tell the so story. So, about a, uh, maybe a little over a year and a half ago, I was like, okay, I'm gonna try this online dating thing. Kind of reluctantly, my friends were kind of pushing me into it. Yes. And, um,. So I was like, okay, this guy, he's kind of cute, and a couple years younger, and he's in his 40s, we're going to go for a walk or whatever. So he asked me to meet him at a local park, which is busy, so I wasn't too worried about that. Um, and then I get there, and then he's like, oh, by the way, there's some things I haven't told you. And I'm like, oh, so here we go. So one was, he, for, like, for someone in his mid-40s, you kind of hope that they're farther ahead in their like security, like job security, financial security. I'm not looking for anyone to take care of me, but I'm not looking to take care of someone else kind of thing. Right. So it doesn't drive, uh, like rents off of his buddy. He doesn't like, have a place to stay. He doesn't, he doesn't have, have a, a place car. to stay. He doesn't have a car. He doesn't, you know, his job's kind of like iffy and I'm like, oh, um, lovely. Okay, let's just finish this walk and have some good conversation. Texting starts like just don't stop after. I can't have a great time. You can't wait to meet my kids. Like, no. Oh my god. Um, okay. All this stuff, right? So I'm like, it's not gonna happen. But meeting your kids or the uh, all next? All of it. All of it. We're done here. So I see. Um, you decided we're done here. Yeah. So then about <laughs> just a couple months, like not even maybe at the end of the summer, my sister's like, I have to tell you, because she's single too. This is her first date since she broke up with her ex. And she's like, I went on a date finally. I was like, oh, that's awesome. How was it? And she's like, absolutely not. Nope, nope, nope. I'm like, well, you have to tell me. So she kind of, I, she mentioned this one point. I think it was about, they went for a walk. And I said, is his name so-and-so? And she just looked at me and she's like, yes. <laughs> I started laughing so hard and she was mortified because she did a little bit more with this person than I did. I like what? Totally, okay, so she had sex with him, and she was like, "Where? Hey, at his place." But I thought he didn't have a place. He was staying at his friend's house. I I see. Okay. So 
Mm -hmm. She's like, you don't understand. I haven't had sex in a very long time. I'm like, listen, you don't have to explain to me. That is, <laughs> that is fine. I'm not judging you. Was I'm it good though? Like, she's or is like, he like? Yeah, she's like, he lied about a lot of things. So I was like, <laughs> okay, so I'm dying. So then. Same wait, thing. wait, hold on, back up, back. He he lied about a lot, like what, like his dick size, and like size of other things on his butt. So like, it was. So like, your your sister asked this guy how big his dick is before she fucked him. No, no, she but the height was like she's like he lied about his height, so I just kind of knew like it might, it might not be the same down there. And I see, I see. It was see. just kind of like he didn't, you know. But <laughs> the funny part is like he and she told him it was. She was honest with him. She said, I am not looking for a relationship. I just got out of a bad one. You know, I'm just looking to see what's out there. I'm not looking for a relationship. And he didn't hear that part. And uh, he started, like, text blowing up her phone, you know. Right. My mom was in town. Oh, I can't wait to meet your daughter. I can't wait to meet your mom. Oh, I can't wait to oh, oh, wake up on Christmas morning with you. And she's like. Oh, my God, dude. She's this like, is after like, one. Oh my God. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> one date. And uh, I was laughing. Is it too bad that this didn't last until Christmas when you brought him over to my house for Christmas dinner and he walks in and realizes that he also went out on a date with your sister. Yeah, that so, would have that would have been interesting. I know. I said there's so many missed opportunities with this because you right? didn't stick it like you didn't hang it in there and like Unlucky. Yeah. Maybe no, next I, time. Next time you meet a creep, don't tell your sister. You know what though? There's something to be said about like just having a lot of cats. I mean, you know, <laughs> make fun of those crazy women in their 40s and 50s with all kinds of cats, but we're the happiest people. Our cats are lit. I tell you. They, uh, you tell me, right? yeah. Okay. Well, hopefully this uh, gets some views on your YouTube. Hopefully. And my sister doesn't see it. I and love you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so does that guy, eh? Yeah, apparently. <laughs> all, right. Okay. So, all right. Thanks a lot. Okay. Take no, care. Have a good night. Okay. Thank you. Good night. Good night. <laughs>